Good morning, everybody. We are getting ready for our wedding at the Chateau Laurier today. So we're at the shop getting everything packed up. Since the temperature is supposed to be below freezing this morning, Emma has gone and wrapped all the bouquets and all the flowers in plastic so that they don't get burned. So our bud vases are all wrapped over here. And we have a couple of buckets. All of our anthuriums are all wrapped up at the front because the anthuriums are tropical and they really, really, really don't like to get cold. So they're all bagged, ready to go. We're gonna load them into the vehicles and head out to the event. Okay, so we are inside uh, the ballroom at Chateau Laurier. This isn't called ballroom. Jesslyn, what's, what's this room called again? The drawing, the drawing room. room. I know that, I just, my brain is not working this morning. So we're in the drawing room today, which is beautiful. They've just redone the carpets in this space. They're very nice, very neutral, a really nice pattern that complements the walls. They've repainted everything in here too. I feel like my camera's not, the camera's not great today, so it's not picking up all the cells. It's also like strange shadows and stuff in here. So I don't know if you can see that ceiling. It's beautifully done. They did a really beautiful job repainting everything. It looks really clean in here. So we've just done our initial meeting. Uh, we've loaded everything in. We have a plan. Our ceremony is happening in the Canada room, which is downstairs. And the recep reception's happening in this space. So we're going to get started up here. Jesslyn is taking a small team down to the Canadian room to make sure everything is ready to go down there so that when we move down there, we are set and we're going to get this thing going. I was getting working on getting all the plastic wrap off of our flowers now that we are inside. And then we're going to start adding our anthuriums to the bud vases so that they're complete to go onto the tables. So linens are down. Mackenzie's going to start prepping our taper candle holders. So each table is getting two 10 inch tapers and one 12 inch taper. So we're going to set up a little station over here so that Mackenzie can get that all prepped and ready to go. And then we'll stop, start dropping them up on the tables. Look at how pretty these centerpieces look with the anthurium in them. It's ridiculous so pretty they're gonna look beautiful on the tables what a huge impact nothing else on the table just these guys and it's already so pretty <laughs> why <laughs> interesting pleating job over the cake table so we have a regular linen on here what size is just 120 uh, or 132? This is 132 yeah. so 132 round linen on this table which is the length we needed because of the corners gets us down to the four but she's using little pearl push pins and wall to overlap with a pleated design just to kind of add a little textured romance to this piece. It's a bit of a tedious job, but it looks really pretty. I'm just gonna get in close to show what you're doing here, Jess. So she's 
she's adding a pin and then folding it back on itself and reusing that same pin to create that pleat. It's a lot of work, but so pretty. I'll come back and show this to you guys once it's all done. For the napkins, we've got these really adorable satin ribbon bows on here. Something that the client asked for specially. This is not something we typically do, but it looks so stinking cute. It adds just another pop of color to the tables. And then our second centerpiece is the candelabra centerpiece. So candelabra, three bud vases three votive candles, these lovely, lovely little napkins. Sonia folded these and uh, tied all the ribbons on for us at the shop. Sonia and Marika, I think, both of them, so that we didn't have to fuss with that today. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Got that on camera. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You know what you're doing. <laughs> I don't help. And then I say probably like two stems at the center. Two stems at the center. Okay. Wait, reshot. I can't plug it. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not reshooting the fact no. that you can't plug the plug in. <laughs> it's not working. <laughs> Reshot. Re -shot, start over. Okay, you did it. Way to go, Ken's. <laughs> oh my god, your face every time. Wait, I missed it. Can you do it again? I'm just. Joking. I'm joking. <laughs> So like I said, the ceremony, woo, look at that here. Ceremony is taking place in the Canadian room, which is downstairs at the Chateau Laurier. And getting into it is a little bit tricky. So we've already made a couple of trips down with some stuff, but I'll take you for the last load that we have to take. Is it locked or? There we go. So first obstacle is this very steep ramp <laughs> that we have to go down backwards so we don't go too fast. Luckily I have a very light uh, object with me right now, so it's not too shabby. I'm going to run back up and close that door. This is bringing us into the Adam room. So into the atom room, so we have to go through the atom room and then over to the other corner. Do you have another wedding in here today? Do you have a wedding in here today too or no? Oh, the reverends, they uh, lodge and then here they meet up. And oh, okay. And then we, we give lunch every year. You have a lunch every year on Remembrance Day? Yes, we for the veterans. Oh, I didn't know that. That's really nice. Yes, yes. That's every awesome. That's still a good number. Okay, so now we're heading into the kitchen's area. So, we're using this little ramp thing here. So anybody who's carrying stuff should know about this little staircase. But since I'm wheeling a dolly around, and I mean, I could just carry this, but just for the sake of showing you guys, this beauty of a contraption. I'm going to use the dolly. Okay, we are on, we are moving. Mackenzie's controlling the mechanism really slow moving elevator. Right, Kenz? 
Yep. I feel like we're actually moving a little faster this time than last time. Maybe it's the other one that was really slow. Okay. There we are. And then we're going to move this elevator here and down to the next place. and on to the next little That was very loud. Sorry about that. So this is our second little ramp area. Which is down. Kim's gonna bring it up. It's very pokey this one. Okay? Okay. Alright, come on in. Kim's just gonna bring a dolly in here. Speed up this part of the video. What? You think I should speed up this part of the video? Maybe just a little bit. You think so? Maybe just a little bit. But maybe he'll want to watch you go all the way down very slowly. Yeah. In real time. Almost there. So close. And there we are. Yeah. Did it. And now we are into the Canadian room. Canadian room here. Our ceremony is all set up in this area. We're going to have an aisle runner going down the middle. We're doing chair covers on all of these chairs and a backdrop behind the stage and then some candles coming down the aisle. And then a little couple of uh, accent arrangements or candles kind of going at the entrance to the aisle. So chair covers are just about finished and I'm going to start working on the backdrop that's going behind the stage at the altar. I did it wrong. This is why we read notes before we start things. So this room's almost fully set. We just have to do chair covers once the chairs are dropped. So I'll show you the way down to ceremony. As promised, I'm showing you guys the finished cake table. So it's all pleated, 
on three sides. And then these little pearl pins are a really nice touch. They're very pretty. So this will look very nice for the cake later. And Jessalyn's just gone and tucked everything around the bottom nicely so it looks clean. Very pretty. And then this for the head table, such a pretty winter vibe without feeling too Christmassy and still feeling very modern. The anthurium brings in that very modern touch, but then we've got the pine trees in the back or the spruce trees with lots of lights. It just creates a really nice warm feeling. And then once these candelabras are lit, that's going to look really beautiful. All right, we're all loaded out and ready to go. That's it for today's wedding. Thanks for following along, you guys, and we'll see you at the next one. Bye.